Hi everyone, my name is Alex and today I am going to continue to speak with you about Duke. A couple of days ago my colleague asked me why I should use Duke if Hibernate provides lots of ability to solve my issues and to work with my project in a simple way. It's a good question and today I am going to provide you some little agenda of my speech. First of all, uh, I am going to tell you about a real case example of using Juke that can provide some abilities that Hibernate doesn't. Uh, also, I am going to show you how to use your model class to fetch data from database and to use it. Also, I am going to show you some uh, SQL constructions using Juke. In addition, I am going to show you how to integrate uh, the way to integrate Juke with uh, Hibernate and uh, Entity Manager. Okay, let's start. Uh, let's imagine that you have a microservice architecture, but uh, you should support your old monolith project, and you you are moving your monolith project from uh, old database and this architecture to microservice architecture. Yeah, but your uh, large amount of your microservices still works with uh, database, monolith database. Yeah, and uh, after every change into database, you should support your entity classes in your microservices. But if you are using Duke, you can uh, create this workflow, the following workflow. Uh, fetch your change sets, apply it using, for example, Liquibase, uh, like in my case, uh, and uh, regenerate the entities in your microservice that, that uh, you are working in. And you can, you have uh, the entities that updated, and you can continue to work with these entities. Yeah. The second question, how can we use uh, your model? Yeah. There is a model right in Kotlin and yeah, I suggest you to start to use Kotlin. It's a very useful language yeah, and you can read some topics about it. Yeah, and uh, you can pass this argument class name in the following construction. Mm, this construction uh, looks the same, almost the same in Java, but okay. Uh, the and if you fetch this entity. using your browser. As you can see, there are this output. Okay, also, Juke provides an ability to return JSON from this method. And as you can see, this structure of response. Yeah, also if you are using uh, Hibernate, you can use um, Juke to construct some native queries. And yeah, as you can see, I have created uh, this construction and uh, use SQL, get SQL method with this Kotlin simplify constru simplified construction and as a result I am going to have uh, the following the following SQL query okay and uh, 
after my updation as you can see name is changed and usually you can use Jupe and Hibernate in one project because there are different responsibilities and different use cases but yeah if you have any further questions feel free to ask me in comment section and you can find this project in my github repository uh, the branch names name is Duke Kotlin and uh, I am going to put a link to my github repository below the video thank you for your attention bye